But Naomi, you'll have your three minutes. After that, Thank one and a half. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, sir, for allowing me to add my voice to this very important bill that we are discussing, Finance Bill 2023. It is a great opportunity for us to interact with this bill. And Mr. Speaker, I must say from the onset that I support the bill fully because it has more benefits for the Kenyans than the, the, the challenges that it produces, it, it poses. And Mr. Speaker, sir, Mr. Speaker, sir, Kenyans have suffered for so long, for many years. The challenges that the Azimio team is talking about has been there for the last many years. And the bill that is on the table today is the solution to our problems. Mr. Speaker, we must be a self-reliant government, a self-supporting government, and this bill is the only thing or the only bill that can make the difference in the situation that we are in today. And I know very well that all the members of parliament want development in their own constituencies and in their own counties, but it is unfortunate today we are fighting the bill that has all the solutions ready for us. And Mr. Speaker, when you look at the manufacturing center, it contributes to 40% of the employment and the GDP in Kenya. The committee has in its deliberation offered a number of reprieve to support the sector and in particular to local companies. And through that, we will be able to employ many youths who are unemployed, will be able to create jobs, will be able to support families that have suffered for many years. Again, Mr. Speaker, under climate change, the global warming has a serious effect on the entire world. But in this bill, we are providing solutions that will have some positive impact on the entire nation. And because of all that, we also see very well that education is one of the major beneficiaries. Mr. Speaker, where there is no vision, where, where, Mr. Speaker, we perish because of lack of visionary leaders. This bill provides us with all the solution, and in order for us to overcome our current challenges, we must support and let us not be emotional, let us support. And it, to our as to our team, Kenya Kwanza, let us be trustworthy, let us take care of the resources that God gives us, and be good stewards. To whom much is given, much is expected. Very well.